G'day, welcome to Pay It Forward. Today is launch day for December Masterclass. I'm very excited about this month's launch because I'm sharing with you what is probably my biggest artistic soft sculpture secret ever. And that is how to add a sculpted face to a plush soft sculpture. Now, it is a very detailed technique and one that I perfected over the years and I'm very excited to share it with you all. I know it's going to help you all absolutely take your work into another dimension, I'm sure. Sculpting a face means we can add all sorts of expression and detail that we can't otherwise do. So I feel like you're all ready for this. I hope you're not daunted by it. Um, it's going to be a very exciting month there in Masterclass. So I have created, of course, a beautiful you'll have seen in the photographs, a Cheshire cat. Now, so many people have asked me for a cat and I thought this was a good way to lead into it because cats are notoriously difficult to create in soft sculpture. So I thought if we did it with a sculpted face to start off with, um, it's certainly a lead in. Also, I've kept the character very animated, so your sculpting job is going to be easier. It's also a two-way pattern, so I'm going to be telling you and teaching you how to create it as a bear. So lots of options there for you. I'm very excited about it. Um, and I love the color. So I haven't used expensive fabrics here to also demonstrate you don't have to be using mohair. In fact, in, with this one, I really think that a good quality Sherpa works even better. But we're going to be having a giveaway and I'm going to be giving away some of that beautiful pink Sherpa and purple plush so you can create your own version. So let's have a closer look at my beautiful Cheshire cat. So here is my boy and isn't he beautifully animated? Now that is the beauty of sculpting a face. So this is the main technique that we're learning this month in Masterclass. And I'm sure it might look very daunting, but I really do take you through it every step of the way. Biggest secret is the attachment of that face to that head. And once you've learnt that, you'll be able to apply it to so much of your own work. This will really move you forward if you're really looking to um, extend your work and um, and your style. So this one is a two-way pattern in that it can be made up as a bear. You can put rounded teddy bear ears on, leave that tail off and sculpt a bear face. So those of you who are used to sculpting, you're going to be really excited by this one, particularly the technique of attachment. So there's a lot to learn this month. This is a brand new pattern, new body pattern. You get the gorgeous rompers as well, and of course the hat pattern. And you can see who wouldn't want to make that hat. I just love top hats like that. I love the Mad Hatter style. And this one's just got so much character. I'll show you all of the painting, those fabulous whiskers, and of course that gorgeous tail. Now I've made this one up in Sherpa because I really wanted to show you you don't have to use very expensive mohair. Both of these are synthetic and very inexpensive. And in fact, our masterclass giveaway today is a piece of the pink, just like mine, the Sherpa, best quality Sherpa, and also enough of the purple plush to make a tail. So that's our giveaway this month. So I hope to see so many of you come over and give this a go because it really is something that you will really enjoy having in your skill set and I'm sure you're going to use it in so many ways. Certainly moving forward we will be doing more of this sort of work. So let's go and have a look and see who's going to win the beautiful pink Sherpa and purple plush giveaway kit. So I hope I've got all of your imaginations going and there's colours running through your head and themes and styles and certainly I know you people, I know so many of you will be already ready to order fabrics and uh, have your colours already worked out before the video is even over. But for one person, you can make up yours in that beautiful purple plush and that pink Sherpa. So I'm going to do things a little differently this time. I'm going to give it more, make it more possible for other people to perhaps win this giveaway. And what I'm going to do is, if you have a cat, if you own a cat, 
I want you to tell me in the comments your cat's name or cats, you may have multiple cats. Just tell me your cat's name in the comments. I'm, I'm really into names and uh, quirky names and cool names. I'm gonna go through those comments in about 24 hours after launch and I'm going to choose my favorite cat name. So it'll be all up to me, but it'll be random. So I'll be basing it not on people, I'm basing it on the beautiful name, something that just, I don't know, takes my fancy or dings my bells. So that's what I'll be doing. So you'll have about 24 hours after launch to get your little kitty cat's names in there and I will send out the one I choose, I will let you know and I will send out that pack with that beautiful Sherpa and purple plush. So how's everybody liking the new Instagram facelift? I wish I could facelift myself um, just as easily. I'm really, really enjoying playing with Instagram now and I'm feeling, as I said before, so much more connected to you all. I absolutely love showing off your work and I just love bringing you into my workshop a whole lot more and bringing you closer, up close and personal with what we're doing. So looking forward to seeing more of you in Masterclass. I'm gonna put the link down below for you to join and also the link to our Facebook page. It's so great to connect with so many of you there and that's a great platform to showcase your work, any work that you've made with my patterns, whether it be Masterclass or Pay It Forward, you're welcome to post it there and I may well grab one of those and share it on my Insta story, which is really exciting. So everybody stay safe, keep on being creative. Remember to talk to me on Instagram. If you ever want to talk to me one-on-one, -on -one, do it through Instagram. It's I'm definitely gonna see your comment there. And remember to ask for what you want. Communication is the key to getting what you want. Um, so always tell me if you have something you, re you request or a pattern you'd like to see, definitely communicate with me and uh, we'll see how we go with that. So looking forward to seeing more of you in Masterclass. Stay safe everyone. Keep on paying all that good stuff forward. Till next time, it is Huru from me.